the author of the book, getting a job is a job. In fact, I, I was actually tweeting some of his um, um, statements. I, I pray the Almighty God will increase you in wisdom, in knowledge and understanding. And I hope that the participants here we leave this place indoctrinating and imbibing the positive rudiments you've received. To the organizers of this program, I want to appreciate you. Anything you start with crowd is a failure. Very mighty things start with humble beginnings. I prefer to talk to 10 people who will carry out democratic evangelism of what they are going to get from me than talking to 20,000 people that at the end of the day, the performance will be a beautiful nonsense like Jonathan. So I want to say to me, talking to you in this hall today is already a great success. I'm happy and excited. To speak like this anywhere, I'm paid minimum of $5,000. I was still in Senegal, Dakar, on the invitation of the United Nations to speak some three weeks ago. I spoke on legislative corruption and money laundry. Today I'm here, I paid my flights to be here this morning, myself and my police aide that I'm trying to get used to because after an assassination attempt on me, some of you read it in the papers and saw it in the TV some um, about a month ago. My family and everybody insisted that I must take protection, but I know that protection comes from God. And I'm actually not killable. So this morning, I'm to talk on building strong institutions. Very wonderful topic. On a day that is called Democracy Day. Actually, today is not a democracy day and cannot be a democracy day. You can only celebrate democracy in a democratic country. Democracy is literally defined as government of the people, by the people, and for the people. But what we practice in Nigeria is greedocracy. Government of the greedy, by the greedy, and for the greedy. If you want to talk about building strong institutions, I want to deviate from those who say you need to build strong people and build strong institutions. When President Obama visited Ghana in the year 2008, you know what he said? He said, for Africa, and specifically Nigeria, to be great, you need to start building strong institutions and not strong people. Because any society that builds strong people, you are building oppressors. You are, using, you are building people who will become so strong that will weaken the democratic institutions, political institutions, and take over the private sector and dominate the economy and determine the political future.